great uh, for Tom Brady. What? Come on, impress me. Oh, okay. Give me some objects. Nah, okay. Here's the thing now. This is the GOAT. Mm-hmm. So now Skip Bayless told me that when we when we gray GOATs, LeBron and mm-hmm. all these other GOATs. Well, there's... Hold on, Skip. He spoke. Skip. He's not the GOAT. <laughs> if we're grading Michael Jordan, we, we'd have another... Okay. If we grade these GOATs, we got to hold them to the highest standard. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm holding Tom Brady to the highest standard. Mm-hmm. By all metrics, he get an F. Wow. By all mm-hmm. metrics. Now, here's the thing. Now, he gave up... I mean, Tom Brady only scored 10 points against a defense that had been allowing 27 over their last three games. Mm. Lost to Denver. Lost to the Oakland Raiders. Now, Tom Brady, the GOAT, mm. only got 10. Now, he scored a touchdown on his opening drive. And everybody like, yep, told you. Mm. But that touchdown came on skip. Mm. Chris Hogan, blown. would you say that was a blown coverage? Yep. Okay, blown coverage. Mm-hmm. Over the final eight drives, he had three points. Mm. Now, there's a reoccurring theme here, Gene. I don't know if you noticed last week you heard me say, over Tom Brady's last six drives against my six drives against the Dolphins, he scored six points. I don't know what you want me to do, Skip. Mm. A horrible interception in the red zone mm. that took points off the board. Mm. Inaccurate. Flinching in the pocket. You saw it. I, I didn't see You that. had LASIK. Might oh. need to get it again. Yeah. You know what? I, know <laughs> the, I got 2010 vision. Yeah. <laughs> But the TV is 30 feet away, so it don't do you no good. Mm. But anyway, Skip, I know what I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you mm. one of these old new high def, yep. one of those Sony 4K, yep. OLED. Uh, OLED. Yeah. Ooh, that thing sharp. That's a good I'll idea for Christmas. Because yeah, I don't right mean nothing. You know, you know what, Skip? Yeah. You see this? Mm. I was supposed to wear this on Christmas Eve. Really? Yeah. But I knew something. I, had. I broke it out early, Jenny. Yeah. Now I don't have nothing to wear on Christmas Eve. Why did you break it out early? Because it was a special day. Andrew Luck did me, one, did me a solid. Special. Really? So did old Big Ben. Huh. So I had to dress up. Are the Cowboys going to lose the NFC? I don't know. We don't talk know. about that. Tom okay. Brady gets an F. You <laughs> know he deserves an F because you saw that performance. Pathetic. Hmm. Ten measly points against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Hmm. Ten. Hmm. That's what he got. A horrible interception. Flinching in the pocket. Hmm. So Tom Brady, if he's the GOAT, he's held to the high standard. Skip, this is advanced. Calculus. Mm. This is advanced play. Everybody can't get in my class. Mm. Do you know how many people sign up and I turn them away? Mm. I take less than two people a year mm. in my class. Mm. Tom Brady in the class, he failing. So mm. he might want to get out of it. Really? Yeah, he <laughs> might want to get up out of here. Well, Jenny, you're going to have to give me an F because I am flabbergasted that you just oh. gave Tom Brady an What you give him? I'm giving him a B. <laughs> Got Here we the go same again. grades. You know, I'm giving him a B because I thought he played very well yesterday against oh. a defense that was sky high to get revenge finally on a Tom Brady who was 11 and two oh. against Pittsburgh. A defense that couldn't get revenge on yeah. Carr, on yeah. Derek, on Derek Carr. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, what about Case Keenum? Could they get revenge on him? Looking ahead, this was it. They all circled it in training camp. This time, that's not going to happen to this team. So Tom Brady goes 25 to 36 for 279. That's that, that's pretty good. It was more than Ben what Roethlisberger. About, what about that ben blown Ben Roethlisberger coverage? threw for 235. What about that blown coverage? Interesting. Blown okay. coverage. Well, he, he hit him right in stride. I don't know. I give him high marks for executing. Did you see the ball handling on that? It's a really complex play because you got all kinds of fakes and reverse fakes. Did you see it? Did you see it? I can't even believe you did yeah. that. Skip. Well, I'm doing it. You could have threw really that good. one. No, I couldn't have done yes, the ball fakes. I couldn't have done. No, but you could have threw that completion. Very complex play. What about the completion? Yeah, I could throw that completion. Okay, thank I would you. Agree. So you what you gonna give him? Okay. Up. So do you realize Tom Brady had to overcome 14 penalties for 104 yards, seven pre-snap penalties? Are those Brady's fault? I I just don't think so. Three drops, two by his one, the, the only favorite receiver he's got left, two by Julian Edelman. He, he threw two balls to Josh Gordon, who I thought was going to be his saving grace this year. I thought he finally had a wide out who could get deep and get open in the mid-range, and he just can't. He had one catch for 19 yards in the first quarter and one other target early in the third quarter, and help me out. What happened to him down the stretch, the, the whole rest of the way in the third quarter and all the fourth quarter, he disappeared. Because I guess he does run, as you said, with a piano on his back. And you admitted to me as we opened the show, Rob Gronkowski is, is sad. It's, it's hard to, he's a pathetic watch now. 
He can't run. He can't jump. He looks like a Frankenstein monster to me. And Brady has to keep going back to a well that used to be full and is now completely dry. It's a dry well. You know it, and I know Can it. You one Am I right about that? You're right. You're, de- yeah. you're absolutely right about Rob Gronkowski. Mm-hmm. But I want to know one thing. We ask all these other quarterbacks, be it penalties or defense not playing well, to overcome that. Why can't we ask Tom Brady to mm-hmm. overcome it if he's the GOAT? So – he, he did overcome 178 yards rushing that Pittsburgh had. No, he didn't. He lost. Yeah, but, but he put them in position to have shots to the end zone to win the game. Well, he also took them out and, of position by, by the way, going that you, pick. you realize that last drive? Do you realize what it was? And I'm sure most people, you were just sitting at home thinking he's going to do it again. No, he's going to do it that. again. He's going to do it again. I never thought you that. You did too. Because nope, I seen him flinching yeah. early. Oh, did you? Yep. So he took the New England Patriots from first and 10 at their 25 all the way down to second and five at the 11, Pittsburgh 11. That's quite a drive. That's a lot of big completions with a lot of mustard on those passes. A couple of them to Edelman were like, whoa. Those are rifle shots. If you don't mind me asking, let's just say for the sake of argument, I'm going to come, I'm going to drive cross country. So I'm going to get in my car from California, L.A., and I'm going to drive to Georgia. But in the process, I blow an engine and have mm-hmm. a flat tire, and I never make it there. What have I accomplished? So what? He drove his team from the 25 down to the 11. Did he get them into the end zone? Did they win the game? Did you see one open receiver on the last three throws of the game? Because oh, I went back this morning and looked carefully at him, and I saw nobody open. I saw Diane I saw Golden Steelers hanging all over Patriots, like, like just suffocating in the end zone. Nobody can get open because he doesn't have an Antonio Brown. He doesn't have a Juju or James Washington or he, even— Remember, Skip, he didn't have him when he outgunned Pat Mahomes. Yeah. Well, he didn't have them. Yeah, but he was playing the Kansas City oh! Yeah. He didn't have them. It was Kansas City. Oh, but I saw, but I saw Chuck and Duck. Yeah. Ooh, well, no, they hit really? not here. Um, they hit not here today. Mm, yeah. 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 Interesting. So, in the end, let's go to that that last crucial, the mm-hmm. second to last series when he did throw the interception. This is this was his first interception he's thrown in the red zone in 180 attempts. This is two years since he threw a red zone interception, and I still don't believe he was really trying to throw the football out of bounds. What? I think he Tom was Brady so desperate lied? for somebody to get open. He thought, I got Gronk on the backside. I got him on Hayden. Uh, maybe if I throw it up high enough, we can have one blast from the past. One last magic One moment. last hoorah. Gronk can go up. Remember the last play of the Super Bowl last year? What did he try to do? He threw the perfect Hail Mary to Gronk, and Gronk is like got semen shoes. Oh, he can't goodness. even get off the Skip, ground. Why would you do would that? You, do you remember that play? It was a beautiful throw. It hit him right in the hands. And, and like seven eagles go and up Gronk, and, ju- and go up high. And Gronk said, had you not fumbled the ball, yeah. we would need a Hail Mary. Mm, yeah. That's what Gronk said. Yeah. Gronk was saying, man, you threw for 505 yards. That's the all-time playoff record in any game. And you threw me a perfect ball. And I'm sorry, Tom, I couldn't get off you know the ground. Skip, now, I remember. Wow. I remember. And I heard you say it. When Tony Romo threw for 507, five touchdowns, mm-hmm. but it was his one costly pick. You killed it. You ripped Tony Romo. Please don't put Tony Romo and Tom uh, Brady in the no, same No, sentence. no, 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 Skip. Please. No, no, no. Please they, don't. Not, all I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, is that I need you to have that same Tony energy. Tony Romo Brady. has, he never even played in an NFC championship game. You realize well, you that? Should, well, you should have left the mm-hmm. Cowboys when mm-hmm. he was the quarterback. Mm-hmm. But you stayed on. Yeah. So you're there now. But we're not talking about them. We're talking about how you, why you keep giving these quarterbacks Bees when they're fa- how you? I-, I thought he played pretty well yesterday. So he makes one desperate throw to Gronk and Joe Hayden. I don't know how tall Joe is. Is he five eleven or six feet? He just skies up over Gronk and snatches it. Well, but he got there and he snatched it. He hung and, up and it was beautiful. It was beautiful to watch. And again, he was the seventh overall pick and has made two Pro Bowls and he's twenty nine years of but age. He, but he's far removed from those Pro Bowls. He got relief from the Browns. Now, he's healthy again, and he's playing yeah. well. But this is not about Joe Hayden. Yeah. This is about Tom Brady. Yeah. This is about Tom Brady in his final eight drives. He scored three points after opening the drive with a 63-yard touchdown to Chris Hogan after the Steelers blew coverage. Yeah. And against the Miami Dolphins the yeah. week before, his final six drives, mm-hmm. he scored six points. But somehow you find a way to— Gets the Dolphins, he threw for 369 and drove them for what should have been the clinching touchdown. And Belichick went run, run, run down at the goal line and took a field goal. Well, Matt, and then the Miami miracle on. happened. Matt Ryan, Way says, to go. hold on. I had a 25-3 lead. What should have been able to stand up in the Super Bowl, mm. but it didn't. So Tom Brady, mm-hmm. you get no, no praise. What mm-hmm. should have stood up? 
You didn't. Now, we're not talking about the Dolphins. Mm -hmm. We're talking about the Pittsburgh Steelers. We are. And you know what? I'm going to amend this question to what grade would I give Bill Belichick for this game? Oh, my goodness. F. Flunk. He's the GOAT. He's the genius. He's, oh according to the Hall of Famer Shannon Sharp, he is the greatest coach he ever, which is, is the biggest bunch of baloney. No, he's not. Heart. Stop saying and that. He deserves an F for yesterday because that's a failure to launch. What about your quarterback? Yeah. I like Ten the way points. the quarterback played. They've been together for 19 seasons. Yeah. And this may, this be, is the, this may be the swan the song most. of the coach. You won't bet me. Yeah. I am glad you guys are not teachers because I Ten. feel like we've got yeah. a, some favorites around Ten, here. Yeah, he got his favorite. Yeah. He got so his favorite. You. No, no, no. I got an advanced class. Mm. You have to get selected to come in my class. Well, somebody was cum laude at Vanderbilt, and he doesn't know anything oh. about grades. I don't know. Thank you I for don't the know. reminder. Somebody I would thank you, Lord. I was State. definitely I not. Yeah. But here we are now. So anyways, what you about the Cowboys? Were they exposed yesterday? How about we get Sean Merriman's take Why not? Yeah. <laughs>